It's going to be wet and cold on our Saturday. Yeah, absolutely. So tomorrow's not a good lake day. Sunday getting a little bit better, but then into next week, temperatures warm their way back up into the 80s. So what's going to be going on for us? We're going to be dealing with temperatures much cooler tomorrow than what we saw today. Uh, rounds of rain through your Saturday. Saturday is a good inside day. Uh, morning temperatures Sunday morning and Monday morning down into the 40s. High temperatures back near 80 by uh, near near Thursday uh, to Friday of next week. As we take a look, your first look at three day forecast. If I can spin it out right now, 54, the best we can do tomorrow afternoon. You notice this arrow indicating that temperatures will fall from the morning hours into the afternoon. Now, on Sunday, we're back up to 64 degrees, which is still well below average this time of the year. Monday, sunny skies and 72, still below average, but we're back onto that warming trend. So, looking at the first alert, radar and satellite tonight, you can see a lot of the cloud cover still sticking around, but already seeing evidence of the upper level energy getting closer towards North Texas, uh, seeing some of that rain off to the northwest. We do have a front that made its way through, has now stalled down to the south, so we have moisture running up and over that as this upper level energy moves its way through. We have the rain that's going to increase in coverage, and you notice that uh, with the rain chance forecast tonight. By the time we go to about 3 to 4 in the morning, jumping from 40% up to 80% to then 100% coverage into tomorrow morning, and then off and on through the day. There will be times of heavy rain at times, uh, tapering off just a bit to some light rain, and then and I expect that pattern to continue through the early afternoon hours into the evening hours. You see that on the first alert future cast. I showed this to you at the top of the newscast, but you're able to see into tonight. And then into tomorrow morning, we're going to be seeing that rain moving its way through at times. Some heavy rain making its way into parts of North Texas, uh, continuing to see that through the late morning hours, then into the afternoon. So you might hear some rumbles of thunder. I don't anticipate any severe weather in the forecast, but some pockets of heavy rain could cause some localized flooding. So just keep that in mind. A lot of the heaviest rain, I think, is going to be in the afternoon to then the evening hours. That tapers off, and then going into Sunday morning, still some leftover rain. So an inch and a half to near two and a half, you read three inches of rain possible in some localized spots. Uh, keep that in mind as you make your plans. You can see in some spots it's 15 degrees colder than this time last night. We're sitting at 65 right now at DFW with a northerly wind at 14 across the Metroplex. Same story low to the mid 60s on the way, but notice tomorrow 59 in the morning drops down to 54 degrees into the late afternoon hours with that rain sticking around. Your first alert seven day forecast. You already saw three days for uh, looks like Earth Day. 47 warming to 72. We're back to 80 Tuesday and then another return of some rain into the forecast by next Thursday and Friday. A chance of maybe even some stronger storms in the forecast. All right, Scott, we'll be watching it all. Thank you.